general evaluator, fellow Toastmasters, most welcome guests, and most of all, Bashar, for your speech that is inspiring and challenging to the evaluator for me right now. Let me tell you a story. A few weeks ago on a glorious Friday afternoon, I did not have any work to do at work. I asked, I have multiple bosses, I asked all of them, do you have any work for me to do? And they said, no, nope, nothing for me to do. So I decided I would take off a little early because it was Friday and it was glorious after all and I started to pack up. And one walked over to me and he's like, you, you came in a little late today. Why are you leaving early? And I was kind of confounded by that. And yesterday we had a team meeting and my boss reminded, hey, everybody has to work eight hours a day. So that's been floating in my head constantly as a piece of feedback that was challenging me. So right away I'd like to thank Bashar for picking a speech on something that is relevant. I've heard speeches that weren't necessarily relevant to me, but this, this grabbed my attention. This was right into my heart, so that was good. Second of all, Bashar is a great speaker because he makes things easy to understand. Bashar started off with a question, who has received feedback that was challenging? He moved on to examples. Then he asked why, as in, uh, why should we be giving feedback that is complimentary? He moved on to how do we give feedback that's complimentary? And then he concluded it. And that made it all very simple for us. I find that with other speeches that I've evaluated, I have to parse, I have to query, I have to group through my head, what, what was the speech all about? Oh, this was very simple. I could sort of sit back in my chair and relax, and it was entertaining. Third, Bashar is naturally enthusiastic, and he was enthusiastic today. I noticed that he toned it down a little bit because he had a visual aid, and so he wasn't competing for attention with the visual aid, which I thought was very smart. But afterwards, he brought up the enthusiasm again, and it was great. Now, how can you take this great speech and make it even better? <laughs> <laughs> I noticed at the start, you took one minute to set up. I don't know if that's standard for speeches with a visual aid, but it was a bit distracting. Though, I want to remind everybody, the guests especially, that Bashar set up the whole meeting today in a brand new location, and so I think we can forgive him for this one small. <laughs> He's always prepared every other time. He did not read off the screen at all until the very last, the conclusion, in which I caught him just reading what's on the screen. So that's something to work on. It's always challenging to find things for Bashar to work on. And I'd like to conclude by saying that it was a great speech, Bashar, and we should all aim to speak with such elegance and grandeur. Thank you.